What is going on, everyone? Today, I am going to be discussing my rest of the year 2016 amusement park plans. Now, this isn't anything major. However, I think that you guys will enjoy with what I have to discuss and what news I am going to be coming up with for the rest of the summer and so forth for the 2016 season. So, anyway, let's begin. So I will be going to Six Flags Great Adventure for Fright Fest and Holiday in the Park. And especially for Fright Fest is what I am excited for because Rage of the Gargoyles, the virtual reality coaster coming to Skull Mountain, is coming for Fright Fest 2016. And I am insanely excited for that. It seems like an awesome experience. I have not yet experienced a virtual reality. However, I am very excited to do so. And here's the thing. I do not think, or at the moment, do not think that Skull Mountain was the best fit since it's already like an indoor coaster. I think that since it's Rage of the Gargoyles and they fly, obviously, or meant to fly, I guess you can say. But I think they should have put it maybe on like Superman Ultimate Flight, maybe Nitro even, one of those type of rides. But I think it would have fit better on one of those like BNM mega huge roller coasters than Skull Mountain. But either way, it's still cool, and I'm still excited. So, that's one of the things I will be doing at for rest of the season for 2016. Six Flags Great Adventures Fright Fest, and I will be going to Six Flags Holiday in the Park, although it's not even really close yet. But however, Six Flags Great Adventures Fright Fest starts September 13th, so it's coming up. However, not too close, but not too far. So anyway, let's go on to the next trip plan. This will excite you guys. I am going to be going to Six Flags New England. This is the final park that I'll be hitting up. Well, final park that's not my closest huge park. Six Flags New England. I'll be hitting this park up on August 23rd and August 24th. Now, I mean, like, I'm going to not really all of August 24th. I'll probably just go there in the morning, then leave. But August 23rd, I'll try to be leaving for in the morning first thing, and then stay there the whole entire day, and then leave August 24th in the morning. However, I'm so excited because this is coming up right next week. Very excited. Very excited for Wicked Cyclone. I hear to most people, actually, it is the best RMC hybrid. I am yet again going to be hitting up one of my favorite all-time roller coasters, Superman the Ride, now Superman the Ride. The last time I've been Six Flags New England was 2013. So I wrote it Superman the Ride when it was Bizarro, and it still remains in like my top five, maybe even. It is a phenomenal coaster, and I hope it stays that way when I do ride it next week. And Wicked Cyclone, I am very excited to ride this ride. I hope it matches up into being one of my favorite steel roller coasters. I could already tell that it could potentially be so, and I'm just very excited. I may also be hitting up the water park, the Hurricane Harbor of Six Flags New England or whatever it's called. I forgot what it's called, but it's a Hurricane Harbor. I know that. However, I am very excited. If you are going to Six Flags New England, please let me know. Please let me know your thoughts on Wicked Cyclone, and please let me know how Superman the Ride compares to Bizarro, because I'm very curious to know and very excited. So what are your park plans for the remainder of, 26, of the 2016 season? Are you going to be going to any new parks for the rest of the year? Are you going to be going to any Fright Fest or Halloween haunts like at the Cedar Fair Park? Or you're just going to be having a good time and chilling around in your home park. I know I'm going to be doing that after Six Flags New England. This is going to be my final park that I visit. That's not my local huge park like Great Adventure for 2016 until next time, 2017. But Great Adventure is still like I'll be going to it like at least twice more during the season. So stay tuned for a trip reports on that. And I'll also give a review on Rage of the Gargoyles when I do indeed ride it. I'm probably hitting up I'm probably gonna be hitting up the Six Flags Great Adventure Fright Fest when it does come out, like the end of September, maybe, maybe beginning of October, I'm gonna be hitting it up. Holly in the park will try to hit up at the end of November, beginning of December. However, what do you guys think of Wicked Cycle and Bizarro or Superman the Ride? I'm very curious to know because I want to boost up my hype as if I'm not already hyped enough to ride both of these rides. Well, Bizarro says Superman the Ride once again, but I am insanely excited to ride Wicked Cyclone. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe, comment, and like, and I'll catch you all next time on Coaster Mania's channel.